Welcome back. The real estate market is the hottest it's ever been, with the majority of home buyers being millennials flocking to low tax states such as Texas, Florida, and Colorado during the coronavirus pandemic. Uh, joining me this morning is realtor Agnes Nakata Blackwood. Good morning to you, Agnes. Good morning, Cleo. Thanks for joining us. I, I think we all know right now that it is definitely a seller's market here in Texas. Um, why is that? And could this really be a bubble? Could this soon change? Well, you know what? We are definitely in a seller's market, Cleo. And I don't I want to encourage all my buyers listening out there. Listen, things go up and things go down mm -hmm. right now. We're in a seller's market eventually we'll be in a buyer's market at some point we'll be in a balanced market so a lot of people don't really know what that means so a seller's market is a term that's used when low supply meets high demand so in real estate this means that there's a shortage of homes available and an abundance of buyers there's you know so many things happening where the prices are actually going up because the leverage is on the side of the seller mm -hmm. so the characteristics that we're seeing are decreased inventory as i said yeah. Yep. less time on the market, extremely low time on the market. Homes are selling extremely fast and of course, increased competition for our buyers. It's a seller's market. <laughs> yeah, competition is real out there right now, but this is a little disheartening for buyers who are trying to look for their first home, their dream home. Um, how, I guess, what are you telling your clients right now as they navigate through this intense market or your buyer, your buyers? Yes, yes. So for my buyers, I am still staying very positive. I'm telling them that it is still your time. Right now, I have a few tips for buyers right now in this competitive seller's market. First of all, to navigate this, we need to move quickly and decisively, okay? First, you need to hire a great realtor yes. like myself. <laughs> Um, no, seriously, somebody who is passionate, dedicated, and, and definitely very patient and stays on top of the market and everything that is going on, okay? Uh, we need to be prepared. Uh, working with a great realtor, let me backtrack, is so important more than ever right now mm -hmm. because with the uh, shortage of inventory, you need somebody that can guide you and also advise you through the entire process. Make sure you don't get taken advantage of, make sure that you don't take uh, make quick decisions that just plain don't make sense. Yeah. You know, uh, secondly, be prepared. Uh, use the resources that are provided for you by your realtor. Watch WFAA, you know, stay on top of the news about real estate and, uh, you know, let us guide you. Let us guide you and always just be educated on what's to come. Exactly. You want to become a homeowner, Google. What does it take to become a homeowner? Um, also, move swiftly this is very very important um, homes are selling faster than ever it's not unusual for us to see multiple offers within 24 hours of a house being listed we actually had a home in plano which had 91 showings and 26 offers okay <laughs> buyers once you are approved it's important that we start touring homes immediately yeah okay. we cannot wait oh, when Agnes I've got so many questions for you and I don't want to lose time <laughs> but but one one important one how are you staying connected with people during this pandemic are people you know wanting to go inside homes right now and how can people connect with you yes I am actually creating the show called the closing table talk show wow. and it's a virtual show yeah where we can just engage talk about all the steps of real estate from getting approved if you don't get approved, credit repair, all the way to the closing table. So I do that on YouTube and Facebook Live every other week. That, oh my gosh, that is awesome. And a lot of people need help, especially uh, first time homeowners navigating through this pandemic as well. Agnes, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you so much, Cleo. And I just wanna say thank you for having me and buyers and sellers, it's all good. Everything's gonna be okay. Exactly, exactly. Thank you so much.